Hey folks, how's it going? Dr. Brian King. Sarah Bollinger. And of course, uh, we're here with uh, musician Sarah Somebody, Tinsley. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> when we were traveling, we found out we were pregnant. Brian was concerned because we have this network of people throughout the country who we would visit and stay with. And he's like, nobody's going to invite us anymore because we're kid people now. <laughs> and I said, no, it'll probably be just different people, you yeah. know? And that's exactly what it ended up being is, you know, some who were like, wow, this is the coolest kid I ever met, you know, and kind of inspired them to think about maybe parenthood depending on their age and others who, yeah, who would maybe not have reached out to us because that was their opinion too, you know, that we're just yeah. a couple and they don't want to deal with kids and now we get invited and we have play dates across the country. Yeah. That's a lot of fun. So you just, you know, that's the life. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes! Yeah! So speaking of play dates, all right, we did bring our daughter along with that objective. Alyssa, you come join us on the couch really quite quick now. <laughs> this is our this is Alyssa. Alyssa has a guitar uh, that was made for her by our friend Clem. It's a cigar box guitar. Well, we thought maybe that you could you know show her a little bit. Uh, and yeah. her. Is that something we could do? Yeah, of course. Here is your guitar. You know what's funny though is I've never played a cigar box guitar, so I'm gonna be learning with you mm -hmm. in a way, right? Mm -hmm. Let me see this really quick though. Can I see this? So, are you left-handed? I'm left. I'm left. Yes, yeah, professional guitar player is now play, uh, playing with your little cigar box guitar. So what's cool is there's only three strings, right? One thing that might be a little hard is pushing and it down. There's two of these and two of them. one of these. Yeah. yeah, but they all sound different, right? Yeah. All different notes, except this is a high version of this one. Yeah. It's a little out of tune. But actually, it's not that out of tune, which is kind of cool. Feel free so, to tune huh? it. Yeah. <laughs> it was tuned at one point. It's not too bad, though. Mm -hmm. The only thing I would say is it might be a little hard for you to press these down just because they're so high up. Um, so, and guitars, right? Um, when you play them and you put your fingers down, it, it's not, it doesn't feel amazing. That's the only thing about guitars, any guitar, right? So if you just know that going into it, and if it's, um, but the thing is, what's cool about it is eventually you develop calluses on your fingers, <laughs> and then it doesn't hurt anymore, you know? Because it protects your body, but protects when, your fingers. And when it's your first time, though, just know it's not going to be the most amazing thing, but when you can play, it is the most amazing thing and it won't hurt, right? And everything that, that's worth anything in life yeah, usually isn't easy. So. No. Are you listening? That's actually yeah. really yeah, good advice. That's true. Yeah. I'm like, can you say that again? Because I think she was being a kid. <laughs> All right, listen, listen, very important. Anything that's worth anything in life isn't easy. You have to work. Right? You have to work for things that you really want. But it's it's usually worth it, especially if you like it. If you don't like yeah. it, then it's like whatever, well, don't do it. Or if you have to do it, then just do it well, even if you don't like it. So take right. your guitar. And so the initial thing is when you play. So this one is strung so that um, it's kind of for um, left hand, but it doesn't really matter because you've never played before, right? So um, I've seen multiple people do different things um, and play left hand and right hand guitar. So mm -hmm. um, what what you do is, so this is a little awkward to hold, but I would just set it right here just on your leg. Just before you play. I would, you, your strumming hand usually is right here. So put this hand down here, your left hand down here. And then over here and is there. where your left hand goes. On you underneath. Cover yeah, underneath, right? Okay, so first, before, usually what I do is before you do anything, you just like strum, right? So why don't you just strum with your hand. You can. Do you want to use a pick or do you want to use your fingers? You can do either way. I have to use your pick. You can keep that one. Thank you. So Terry can use a pick. Yeah, cool. Right on. Look it. Ah. Yeah. And playing each string and play the la the um, highest string. So this is the lowest sounding string, right? And then this is the highest sounding string. And then do the middle and the high. Yep. Yeah. Oh, 
we'll call this string number one, string number two, and string number three. So it's three, and a two, one. Okay, now try strumming them all at the same time, right? Just playing like this, I'll show you. Like, like, like that, so you pick. But all at the same time. Yeah, that's cool. All right, so I would just say, can I see that for one second? Because I've never played one of these before. And I just want to like, these are a little hard to press down. <laughs> so these this is pretty hard to press down so I'm not sure like since um, your hands are a little small and like you know not not um, drained right yet it might be a little hard to press down but let's just try it anyway right um, yeah so for that um, I would just let's try pressing down on one of the strings at one time, because that'll be the easiest thing to do instead of pressing all of them. So let's try doing, let's see. Hold your guitar up, baby. Let's try doing the biggest string, because that'll be the easiest one for you to press, I think. Hold your guitar. Hold your guitar. Yeah, and so, um, so. Put your hand underneath. Yeah. Put your hand this underneath. Like this, underneath. Bring it underneath. There, there you go. Down here. And then you can hold the pick with this hand. Try. And if you can't do it, it just takes practice, right? And so you honestly, just try pressing anywhere, maybe about this area right okay. here. Pressing the, one, the low one. And you want to come around with this hand like that, like that, with underneath with your left or your right hand. This way, underneath. Yeah. All the way, reach over there. Yeah. Cool. Just push down. And you just press Not down. Pull, push. Like this. And honestly, like what you can do. Since this is a little, because there's no frets. <laughs> yeah, so that's easier. That's just easier, right? Yeah. It is. You just like. But the way to get out sound though, because it won't, it'll just sound like like that. So you want to come around and like feel the strength in your hand. So since you don't have frets, you can use multiple fingers to press this down. Oh, that's right? an idea. Because then it'll go down all the way. I know it's a reach, isn't it? It is. It's, it's a little hard. Yeah. And you can, if you wanted, you can try this one. This will just be well, a that would be little easier, bit probably. weird, just because it's so small. Okay. There. And yeah. then this. And then don't let's um, only use the three or two fingers, but don't use your pinkies because pinkies like mm -hmm. are a little weak. Just for now, first time. But what's cool about it, right, is like you could just literally just strum it, like, and it'll be the yeah. same. It'll be the same chord over and over again. But I wrote my first song with only one chord. Yeah. It was called Spring. So you can either strum or you can just play each note separate. Yeah. And then most of my younger students, this is what they would do. Yeah, yeah. And just experiment, right? Yeah. Yeah. But I would say if you want to practice, practice strumming with your hand and then practice doing each note separate okay, at first. Okay, I'm going to now. Okay. That was awesome. Yeah, so now we, we'll, we'll practice that. I just thought it'd be a cute moment yeah, for the, for the video. And, and I really think that was kind of cool, and I appreciate you doing yeah, that. Yeah, for sure. Know?